has been separated from her parents almost her entire life. She's an American citizen, having been born while her parents visited. They live in Pakistan. As her condition worsened recently and doctors declared her time short, she launched a social media campaign, begging for one thing, to see her parents. Living up to each day that my parents would come. In less than two weeks, visas for her parents were granted. I'm Tammy Rose. And while good news for that little girl, bad news for retailers across the country. Smaller than expected Black Friday crowds have been reported all across the country. Analysts are saying that the bargain hunters went out on force on Thanksgiving evening rather than Friday morning to take advantage of discounts on electronics and many other holiday gifts. Many shoppers also snapped up deals online. More than $820 million was spent at retailers since midnight last night. Analysts expect to see an increase of at least 3.5% in holiday sales this year, an increase of 14% over last year. USA Radio News. MJWellness.com, the largest medical marijuana community in the world. Connect with thousands of patients, doctors, industry leaders, and businesses through shared personal experiences along our worldwide network. Discover new therapies and benefits with content tailored to you. Come grow your network on mjwellness.com. You're not alone. Your wellness matters. Learn, live, and thrive. Check out mjwellness.com today. Cannabis Confidential with Dr. Dina. Candid. I want to give you the inside story. Captivating. I want to introduce you to my kind and amazingly talented friends. Compelling. We get to meet some of the most amazing cannabis activists and warriors around. Listen in as medical marijuana pioneer Dr. Dina shares never before heard stories, chats with cannabis insiders and celebrity friends, and provides invaluable perspective and insight into one of the fastest growing industries in the world. I want to share with you what was once confidential information. Let's expose the truth, discuss the issues, and learn the facts. Cannabis Confidential, only on CannabisRadio.com. USA Radio Network Sports, I'm Ray Canterbury. The season is over for Dallas Cowboys quarterback Tony Romo. Romo fractured his collarbone on the final play of the third quarter Thursday night against Carolina. The injury is a hairline fracture, but it comes in the healed portion of the fracture Romo suffered against Philadelphia September the 20th. The NBA resumes play Friday night with a full slate of games. The Bulls are in Indiana tonight to take on the Pacers. The Pacers are coming off a blowout win over Washington Tuesday. Pacer forward Paul George had a season-high 40 points, and Indiana coach Frank Vogel says George is an elite player. Yeah, it's tough to quantify in words. I mean, you know, he just does so much. You know, he's capable for going for 40, uh, carrying the offensive load, and, and being the best defensive player on the floor on, on either team. You know, so, you know, he's a, he's a special player. Cleveland's at Charlotte, Washington at Boston, Philadelphia at Houston, Detroit visits Oklahoma, San Antonio's at Denver, it's Golden State at Phoenix, and New Orleans at the Clippers. And this is USA Radio Sports. In the beginning, man had to painstakingly brave the elements and scale the highest mountains just to deliver the good news. Hear ye, hear ye. Now they just go to ChristianPress.com. It's fast, affordable, and much easier on the joints. Quickly and painlessly deliver your message with ChristianPress.com. ChristianPress.com connects you directly to thousands of journalists, media outlets, news networks, and social media platforms, ensuring your message hits the mark. Every time, your audio and digital content will be professionally produced, so your business or organization's message stands head and mountains above the rest. So reach your target market and get the results you need with ChristianPress.com. Or call 316-644-6185. That's 316-644-6185. Friends, Romans, and countrymen, lend me your... Okay, Skippy, you can get off the mountain now. We found ChristianPress.com. Spread your good news. Visit ChristianPress.com today. On NHL Ice Friday, action takes place throughout the day. Pittsburgh skates into Columbus as the Pens try to gain momentum from a 4-3 overtime win against St. Louis Wednesday. Pens defenseman Ben Lovejoy said they played well. I think we played a great game. I thought 87 was awesome. I thought our fourth line really set the tone. 
they they really dictated the the play. They were behind that net the whole time, and they were wearing down some of their very good defensemen, and I thought that that made a big difference. Meanwhile, there's one final. Boston beat the Rangers 4-3 on home ice. Other games include Chicago at Anaheim, Tampa at Washington, Montreal at New Jersey, Edmonton at Detroit, and Vancouver's in Dallas. Top 25 hoops, couple finals in the books. Number 10, Gonzaga dropped number 18, UConn, and number 20, Wichita State was upset by Alabama 64-60. Other games include... Number 8, Villanova meeting Georgia Tech. Number 23, Xavier against USC. Ray Canterbury, USA, Radio Network Sports. Cannabis Confidential with Dr. Dina. Candid. I want to give you the inside story. Captivating. I want to introduce you to my kind and amazingly talented friends. This is the USA Radio Business Report. I'm Russ Jones. Black Friday's here, and Dr. Scott B. with the Cleveland Clinic says many folks live for the thrill of getting a good deal. We're stimulating parts of ourselves that don't get a lot of attention sometimes. And again, if it's not problematic, if it's not spilling over, costing too much, there's nothing wrong with, you know, delighting that part of your brain. Bargain hunting can be like panning for gold. You have to sift through a lot of items to find the gym. When you find that gym, Dr. B says big alarms go off in the reward center of your brain. He says that delightful brain chemistry makes you more likely to repeat the behavior. I've run into plenty of people who have stacks and stacks of new stuff they bought because it was a bargain, but they've never opened it. They never really had a real use for it. So make sure if you're shopping for a bargain that it's something that you're really going to use. If you're looking for more news, we're on the web at westernjournalism.com, and it's free. I'm Russ Jones. MJWellness.com, the largest medical marijuana community in the world. Connect with thousands of patients, doctors, industry leaders, and businesses through shared personal experiences along our worldwide network. Discover new therapies and benefits with content tailored to you. Come grow your network on mjwellness.com. You're not alone. Your wellness matters. Learn, live, and thrive. Check out mjwellness.com today. about all things cannabis this is cannabisradio.com a service of cannabis media stand by for another great hour of cannabisradio.com but first let's get you informed with news around the world in 90 seconds USA Radio News, I'm Jason Wirt. The standoff is done in Colorado Springs. A gunman has been taken into custody after holding off police for hours by shooting at them from within inside a Planned Parenthood. Police Department spokeswoman Lieutenant Catherine Buckley praised the response of officers. I know that our, our officers acted with untold valor to make sure that individuals were safely taken out of the Planned Parenthood building. We also had officers that immediately responded to the surrounded businesses and they made sure that people received any type of medical aid and they were safe in those surrounding businesses. Republican presidential candidate Donald Trump received some bad news today. A new Reuters poll shows that his rankings have dropped 12 percent in less than a week, the largest decline since he rose to the top of the Republican field. The real estate mogul was a favorite of 43 percent of Republicans five days ago. Today, just 31 percent. USA Radio News. From Feature Story News in Washington, I'm Rebecca Foster. Turkish and Russian officials are continuing to go head-to-head over the downing of a Russian jet that allegedly violated Turkish airspace Tuesday. France has held a memorial service for the 130 victims of the deadly Paris attacks that took place two weeks ago. This as a sixth person in Belgium has been arrested and charged in connection with the attacks. 
Dr. Dabber, hurry! Its temperature is shooting past 1,000 degrees Fahrenheit. It's burning up! I'm afraid for this little guy, it's just too late. What caused the problem? Only Dr. Dabber can maintain the perfect temperature for a smooth-tasting, slower burn. This standard vaporizer lost all of its health benefits, sending it up in smoke. So you're telling me that most vapor pens burn so hot they produce smoke, not vapor? Correct! Keep away from those standard vaporizer pens and turn to Dr. Dabber. Doctor's orders. Less heat, <laughs> more flavor. Cannabis Confidential with Dr. Dina. Candid. I want to give you the inside story. Captivating. I want to introduce you to my kind and amazingly talented friends. Compelling. We get to meet some of the most amazing cannabis activists and warriors around. Listen in as medical marijuana pioneer Dr. Dina shares never before heard stories, chats with cannabis insiders and celebrity friends, and provides invaluable perspective and insight into one of the fastest growing industries in the world. I want to share with you what was once confidential information. Let's expose the truth, discuss the issues, and learn the facts. Cannabis Confidential, only on CannabisRadio.com. Growing green to generate more green. The Grow Show with Kyle Cushman starts right now. Only on CannabisRadio.com. Growing green to generate more green. Welcome to The Grow Show with Kyle Cushman. Each week we plant the conversational seeds about cultivation and the changing climate of cannabis culture. We'll peel back the layers of benefits of the world's most versatile plant, from food to fuel, from remedy to resource. CannabisRadio.com proudly presents The Grow Show with your host, multi-award winning grow master and respected cannabis consultant, Kyle Cushman. Hello and welcome to all you astral travelers, cosmic junkies, and earth surfers. This is The Grow Show on CannabisRadio.com, and I'm your host, Kyle Cushman. Today's topic is curing reefer madness. You know, in the past, when somebody said reefer madness, the first thing I'd think of is some old propaganda-spewing production released under the guise of both education and entertainment by the government. Nowadays, I feel like reefer madness refers to the false belief that cannabis is a scary, addictive substance that will destroy the world. This mass delusion that somehow a plant that has been used for literally millions of years by hundreds of millions of human beings without a single recorded incidence of fatal overdose could be toxic or even evil. Unfortunately, while a mention of the vintage flick usually gets a chuckle, its premise is no laughing matter. Beliefs based on those very lies are being fought to this day. The misinformation of the public about cannabis is responsible for epic rates of incarceration and untold amounts of needless suffering by millions. The biggest travesty is that cannabis should be highly exalted for its unique attributes. And anybody who's had any personal experience with cannabis can vouch for its safety and effectiveness, both for medicinal and recreational use. Education seems to be the key to curing ignorance, so I say that cannabis itself is the cure for reefer madness. So, my guest today is one of our most highly regarded advocates for the freedom to use cannabis, Dr. Lester Grinspoon. He is the Associate Professor Emeritus of Psychiatry at Harvard Medical School and author of the books Marijuana Reconsidered and Marijuana the Forbidden Medicine. Dr. Grinspoon is a fellow of the American Association for the Advancement of Science and the American Psychiatric Association. He was founding editor of the American Psychiatric Association Annual Review and the Harvard Mental Health Letter, which he edited for 15 years. He also has two websites I think you'd like to visit, Marijuana the Forbidden Medicine at www.rxmarijuana.com, which highlights thousands of individual anecdotes concerning the medical uses of marijuana, as well as question and answer. And he shines a spotlight on the uses of marijuana at www.marijuana-uses.com which allows people to submit essays relating to the enhancing effects that marijuana can have on the user. The focus is on effects which are meaningful for the individual, not merely increased appetite, but rather effects such as increased creativity, rushes of insight, new ideas, or increased appreciation for music, art, and nature, all the things that we we know cannabis is really good for. With experience and accolades practically too numerous to mention, I am honored and very excited to welcome him to the show. Welcome to The Grow Show, Dr. Grinspoon. Thank you. I'm delighted to be here. How are you today? I'm fine. Nice Very good. In New England. It is. It is. I'm an East Coaster myself, 
I often miss the East Coast with our wonderful weather out here every day. I like a little rain and cloud every now and then. Right, or the leaf changing, which we're enjoying now, the color uh, and the leaf. So beautiful. Dr. Grinspoon, we've never met in person, although I have attended many of your keynote addresses over the years at normal conferences and alike, and I want to thank you for your outspokenness, which has undoubtedly furthered our fight to normalize, decriminalize, and all-out legalize marijuana. Thank you very much. Yeah, it's been a pleasure. Well, over the years, you certainly have many accomplishments, and for the people that aren't familiar with your story, could you provide a little background on your career and how you got started as a cannabis advocate? Yes, I'll be glad to. You know, I was on a 